truth is, the game was rigged from the start. Welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. I think this is episode eight. Um, it's been a while since I recorded. I've forgotten what I was doing. However, uh, we have Raul now, which is all that matters. So I'm thinking that I could go. God, I just hit M to look at the map. Too used to Far Cry. Hmm. God, I wish the Brotherhood of Steel didn't hate me. Let's go here and just keep heading north. Remember, I was trying to head north. Right, this is why I didn't go here. Shit. Do you have any money? You're not one of my regular. What do you have for Jeff? sale? Hey, what? All right. I'll take some of that. Yeah, sure. I don't really need the machete too much. Of course, I've already also emptied my uh, inventory for the most part. Pleasure doing business with Take it easy. You too, dude. Alright, so we'll head around this. We'll go east and then we'll head north. Red Rock Canyon really is a very beautiful part of the map. It's probably why people settled here, despite the fact that it's uh, relatively inhospitable, but you know what? Canyons provide cover. I don't see enough people living in canyons. The only other I can think of off the top of my head is the people who live in the sky from near. They live on a bunch of platforms suspended between two halves of a canyon. But, like, they don't live at the bottom of the canyon. They don't give a shit about the canyon's bottom. Take a sip from that trusty Vault 13 canteen. So, yeah, I've uh, kind of gotten out on doing uh, Fallout New Vegas. I... I've been forgetting and neglecting to do it. Uh, however, I've recorded so many of them so far in advance that you won't actually notice. Right, yeah, I totally even forgot about all my quests. I don't even have a quest selected, but whatever I do will probably be really easy on account of Raul being with me. I've also got a pretty bitchin' character myself. I don't even remember. I so don't remember where I am, God. Okay, yeah, I got cowboy. God damn it, not again. Huh. Keeping quiet. Unless my creaky knees give us away. So I don't know if I mentioned this last time because it was a several while ago. But that's uh, that's Danny Trejo. In what I think one of his best roles. This is your uh, daily reminder that Machete is in fact in canon with all the Spy Kids movies.
I've just been playing a lot of XCOM recently. So I'm very used to gambling on percentages. to run dry on this actually wow look at that oh god what do I even want 90 repair let's go down to 80 I don't need to get the perks yet let's push guns up there we go and let's pick out a different gun to start using. This'll do. For now, at least. You know, it's not a fantastic gun, but it'll get the job done. And then you also need to eat. Hmm. Oh, that'll do. That should do, at least. This game's crappy, and yet still simultaneously beautiful vistas, you know? Like, it's, it's remarkable how it's simultaneously great and also ugly to look at. I've really got the drop on these fools, huh? <laughs> nice. Good also, Raul. Eating good tonight, boys. Nothing but gecko meat for days. Nope, okay. I feel like I've been in here before, but I can't remember being in here recently. Sorry, I feel as though I've been in here recently, I should say. Rahul's just taking Bean on fire like a champ, you know? Oh, man. I really want to see a side-by-side -side comparison of, like, all the, uh, all the 90s RPGs that got turned into modern games. Which I know is a very, like, might be a, a kind of narrow thing to say, but, like, Fallout, XCOM, Syndicate... Oh, there are more. Fallout, XCOM, Syndicate. Were all uh, games... They were all isometric RPGs in the 90s. 40 pounds of beef. Yeah, that'll do it. No, 30 pounds. Um, and they were all updated in, you know, very specific ways. Syndicate became, like... A very traditional boring military shooter with like a boilerplate story and mediocre game mechanics follow turn into this hybrid shooter RPG which is probably a really good pick for it XCOM almost got turned into a really crappy third-person shooter but then got turned into basically just an like HD Remix. What happened? <laughs> also, I'm dead. 
Alright, well, let's go in a little louder then, huh? Bust out the 20 gauge. Okay, so that's what's happening. They're just doing a whole lot of damage to me. Uh-oh. Oh man, huh, okay. Well, then maybe we can try a bit of a different approach. Raul, still got that missile launcher? Let's go out the left path first. I feel like I was doing better with sure, that. Boss. The old man will crawl around in the dirt to keep hidden. <laughs> He's so uppity sometimes. One more in here. All right. I'm well aware that I've mentioned this many, many times before, but I have always wanted to write sequels. I love, um, I really love a lot of sequel, uh, sequels and how they take on the game that came before it. Sequels to video games, specifically. gonna work better? <laughs> Unfortunately not. Very well. At the very least, I'm starting from a much easier place. Yeah, Raul has died. Also me again. Well, how about this? Could also just leave. So what do I even have on me? Got a varmint rifle. just want to kill them all, you know? Is that weird? But yeah, the way that XCOM handles, like, the games that came before it, and to a lesser extent, um... Been doing this longer than you. Oh, my health. Okay, yeah, I'm really not used to taking as much damage as I do. I'm gonna have to get this stuff fixed, huh? Alright, wow.
Okay, now we start this. Take some of that. Yeah, let's do some of that then, huh? Perfect. Now, yep, there you go. All it takes is just careful management of the situation. Much better. Ooh, man, look at all that meat. Getting lots of gecko meat. And hide, for that matter. All right. Roll, I needed to bust it open. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Um, I've got a lot of, uh, misks, yeah? And yeah, one of those. I'm sure all the lead on me can't help. Ah, oh, damn it. I've forgotten the button to wait. The hell is the wait button? Oh, hey, it's a guy. You look like you got it pretty hard, fella. It's my lucky day. Um, wow, so, uh, hey. I expect to be awed by your dizzy mercantile sense, boss. I love his voice so much, dude. All right. I've only got a little bit of this. So I'll give you those back. All right. Weight is V? Okay. Perfect. Now we can continue our hop north. Though, in pushing north, I have already found more places. So I would like to get, um, I'd like to be able to get to Kamakaren and hopefully grab some... Yeah, I would like to be able to get to Kamakaren and then get some armor. And then following that, I just remembered where I'm heading. Keeping quiet, unless my creaky knees give a... That's the way. Yeah, so. We're heading to an area uh, filled with fools known as the Fiends. Called that because they are fiends for drugs. Doing this quest will hopefully get me back into the good books of the NCR. Yeah, yeah. Time to work by Nice. You like the side of your own blood? So yeah, they're all crazy. Drug crazed. Drug crazies. Ah, someone was behind me, I see. I really don't want to have to drop my lightweight leather armor. But its ability to protect me is getting worse and worse as it goes.
Like, the condition is non-existent. God, I... Just starting to wish I had some better weapons. The thing about the cowboy perk is that it is good. Because it gives you all your, like... A lot of these, um... Like, guns that get the job done. All of those guns will just be better. But, like, for big, big whammies, you don't really have much in the way of that. Oh, boy. Dog meat, indeed. Metal armor. Heavy, but... Ah, oh, Raul will need it. Speaking of which, where is that son of a gun? Oh. He's handling it. Thank you, Raul. So yeah, we get their hex. That's how we, uh, that's how we... That's how people know. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Alright, I gotta get some of this out of my inventory, bro. More of this, I should say. Oh, why do I do this to myself? Here, have a few doctor's bags. Then come on up here. Sure. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Boss. Metal armor. And now... Nice. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Perfect. Now we do a quick save. Human flesh, huh? Yeah. I could also just go to New Vegas, but I'm kind of wanting to save going to New Vegas until later. Also, yeesh. Frame rate's all over the place here. Let's, uh, let's discover this, and then I want to see if I can cut around the next fiend areas. Alright, Poseidon guess. I like how it's called a gas station, but I don't know if they actually provide gasoline. Um, because as I'm sure everyone knows by now, in Fallout, Fallout is all post-nuclear. There is no, uh, a lot of the technologies used by Earth are just non-existent. Like, uh, a lot of circuit boards, I never liked the portrayal of circuit boards in Fallout. Very early on, it was established that, like, the circuit board was never really invented as it was in the real world. So they just all had vacuum tubes still, which is why the, like, the 50s aesthetic of, like, ah, Sky Captain Another Ultra, you know? That's why it all looks like that. Yeah, it has to do with, um... Like, the technology available to the people of the Fallout universe. Oh, I'm getting to the Gunrunners, actually, aren't I? Fiend. This could be trouble. Who are they fighting? What is that noise? 
never heard anything like that. I should probably recognize that, seeing as how distinctive it really sounds, but... Okay, I'm hiding now. I just... I just fucking shit my pants. That was the scariest thing I've ever seen. I've got laser weapons. That's not... That's hardly fair. Okay. You've made your point. I see where you're coming from. Okay. Let's have a few of these then, huh? Gotta cook all my stuff so I can't actually... eat a lot of what I would like to eat. Shit, man. I got too caught up in the rhythm. <laughs> Gross. I want to, like, mark them like it's, like it's Far Cry. Oh, hey, Raul. Oh, man. Oh, wait, is one up here? Yeah, they're fighting. Yeah, one's behind me. That's why Raul keeps getting held up. You like the sight of your own blood? You're really with all. Okay, there's one. You like the sight of your own blood? You like the sight of your own blood? Guys, I think someone you're you're projecting, you know? Gonna need some stronger, uh, gonna need to be a little more resilient than I am. Okay. Do I have any medics? That would be, that would go down real smooth. He's still using his, yep. Sure thing, boss. No. I don't care how many it takes, I will save Raul. Is he okay? No, he's not. God, I totally just wasted a whole bunch of stim packs trying to heal him. Oh, then I also forgot to heal myself. That's okay. All right, I've got to get to him and tell him to stop shooting or to start shooting. And then I'm going to be going into melee, so I'm going to need this. Sure thing, boss. You like the sight of your own blood? Okay. So I need better gear, which will come from that. <gasps> Game crashed. <laughs> you can still see my Boromir meme back here from XCOM. That's funny. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. Hey, we're back. So, uh, yeah, they're all they're all pretty much dead. I'm actually good on uh, armor now. The stuff that I'm wearing is full. Oh man. 
I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Um, take this. But yeah, my arm is full. I just recently, uh, one of them dropped a caravan shotgun that I repaired this thing with. So yeah, I'm feeling good. Oh god, get to cover. That was, uh, that was pretty dumb. Um... Gotta remind myself that not every game is Doom. Okay, where's the last one? You like the sight of your own blood? <laughs> lovely, lovely. Alright. How old are you? He is perfect. Oh, man. <sighs> hmm. I'm so, I'm so close to not being full. And yet, how about I drink some whiskey? Can't get addicted to it. I just remembered, yeah. Still got Logan's loophole on. So I don't know if I want to push the main quest forward, but I'm also not exactly sure what I should be doing. Uh, if not that. So uh, what I'm thinking here, Thinking I could probably, uh, I might start a DLC actually. Cause yeah, the plan was to go, was to do a side quest. Specifically, I was going to do the side quest to get the NCR all the way over to Prim, I think. Oh, okay. Let's just do a little safety quick save here. Like that. Remember the scorpions, huh? Boy, you were stupid. Okay. I'm just gonna do a little experiment. I expect to be awed by your dizzy mercantile sense, boss. Okay, these can't be repaired together. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Boss. Then I'll just leave your naked corpse here, random guy. I feel nothing for you. Oh man. I hate having an odd number of uh an odd number of bullets with a even numbered clip or magazine. Apparently there's quite a kerfuffle about getting those two confused, clip versus magazine. I like to say whatever one will make people more mad. I feed on salt, you see. So the thorn is where we can pick up one of the game's more, uh, shall we say, notorious side quests. Uh, it's about killing a bunch of animals so you can have sex with this girl. I can't remember what the actual name of the quest is, but I refer to it as On Top of Red Lucy. Because it reminds me On Top of Old Smokey. Don't think that's the name. We though. don't need the NCR. I'm glad mean son of a bitch is on our side. That sweetie sure is something. Interesting. Uh, we're near the Gunrunners, though, aren't we? This is the same town that they're in, so I'm going to try to get there, because Gunrunners is pretty much the best place to get stuff. At some point, money is going to be completely irrelevant. Like, hilariously, hilariously completely irrelevant. Um, 
Especially after a certain side quest, a certain DLC, rather, that I'm going to do. Up there is... Getting a little clip there. Oh, yeah, I learned that that red line, that, uh, or the black line that appears in the middle of the screen when we zoom in with um, certain NCR helmets on, that's a known bug. It's just whenever you have the helmet on. I'm not sure what causes it, but I think it's the hat. Which is just so funny. God damn, video games. Video games, man, sometimes they're just held together with prayers. I always like this town. I, um, some of the really good parts of Fallout 3 just come from just exploring a really bombed out, like, shitty environment. Because there's a lot more decay in uh, environment in... Like, there's, there's less fucked up cities in uh, Fallout 1 and 2, I think. Heckler and Hawk Tool Factory. There are some, like, busted up cities, but you never really get to see a lot of it. Just because, like, it's because of the isometric view. And, like, I'm not here to shit on isometric views. I think it's a great pick. Especially for games like that, but, like, man, you know. I just feel like it could be handled uh, in a better way. Personal space meaning anything to you, guy? Watch yourself around here. Freeside is the king's turf. Remember that. <laughs> Man. Hi. I forgot how much Yuri Lowenthal is everywhere in this game. Oh man, is that... Okay, it's a fiend. Good, I'll kill, I'll kill fiends ten times a day. This is the Crimson Caravan Company, though. I think they hate me here. Yeah, they do. There it is, it says hated. Let's make a little safety save here. Start to maybe settle around. Holy shit, what is happening? War with the fiends? Sometimes I miss the uh, the fact that I can't mark targets in Far like I can in Far Cry. you guys shoot me? Hey there. Need anything? Hell no. Cool. Sure. All right. I need a lot of these. Gun's starting to run dry. I really like these things. I like having them in my inventory, but, like, I don't know if I can... That's... Oh, uh, wow. That's too, ex that's too cool to use. When am I ever going to use that? I've always thought plasma grenades are ludicrously overexpensive. Dog eyed. Um. Yeah, that reminds me. Get all this out of my inventory. Know what I mean? Didn't I have. Misk. Oh, I kept gecko meat on me. I should, uh, I should go get the gecko hide off of him. He's got one of my uh, varmint rifles, so I don't think I'll need it. And then what else does she have? Baseball bat cork core. That's really funny. I love this game, man. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. All right now, you have stuff. Hey. 
Hey there. Need me? All right, hand it over. Your money, I mean. Of course, now that I'm doing this, I don't actually have a reason to go find the gun runners, but I will later. Because the gun runners are dead useful to have. Hell yeah. Hey there, need anything? And I'm just gonna see what she has. Dynamite and a varmint. Absinthe. Ramen steak. Some dragon's breath. That's good stuff. And 30 caps of that. Well, while I'm here... I could get rid of a chunk of my gecko meat. Because, like, it's good, but, like, it isn't that good. I'm never going to need... F well, I will, but, like, I'm never going to need it in the sense that I'm not going to, like... S my expenditure of gecko meat is not going to be that ridiculously high. I, I'm going to get more gecko meat, or more other better foods, in fact, before I even have a chance to cook that. In fact, I still have better foods before I have the chance to cook that. Like, I don't want to eat it because I want to save them, but, you know. So. Welcome, sir or madam. Do you wish to purchase something? I am ready to process our transaction. Oh, I forgot to say it. Show me what you have for sale. So this is just basically the best place to get weapons. To the point where running here is like straight busted. Um, it's a material rifle. Nice. Like I said, at some point, um, getting stuff from here is going to be completely irrelevant because we're going to have so much money that we can hand over a specific item and then come back and be like, hey. But what we're looking for is the medicine stick. The medicine stick is a modified version of the trail carbine, I believe. Uh, you can see that the damage is prodigious. However, it's extremely expensive. Uh, the service rifle is just the thing that... Sleeping time, nice. Two-step goodbye and an apartment. Come back and see us again soon. So yeah, that is, uh, that's some good stuff. The medicine stick might be one of the best weapons in the entire game. Let's do a little save. And then let's just see. Damn. Forgot. I already forgot. This is what I get for coming back to an RPG months after I record it. Like, that is a thing that I really just should not do. Um... Let's head to near Good Springs. Uh, yeah, Good Springs source. Cause I wanna, I wanna cook up all the raw stuff that I have. Boop. Four dog steak. Very nice. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now I should eat uh, some of the stuff that I have. Let's drink some water. Let's have some bloat. All right, cool. And then... I don't want to get to Camp Karen. 
I will be shot at, though, which is kind of an issue. Well, let's check the quests. Let's see what I could be doing. Because I don't want to be aimless. TR. Well, we could do this. Let's do that. Where are we dropping? Boulder City. I'm already hated. I'm pre- I, I'm pre-hated at Boulder City. This is- That's one of the things that I'm- I don't know if I like about New Vegas. Where, like, you can screw yourself out of certain quest lines just because you don't know that you're not supposed to shoot guys. And, like, in my case, I'm avoiding saves coming, and I just got in a fight and couldn't, you know, get out of that fight. And that's just an unfortunate uh, symptom of the game that I'm playing right now. Other than that... Oh, crap. Well, what could I expect? Other than that, though, this game's very good. However, you know, as I say, it's got some stuff. Some problems. But hey, what game doesn't? Get back, Arizona Tex. Um. Hmm. Oh yeah, here we go. Should give me 120 hit points. And I can just keep creaming dynamite over there. Dino might. Oh, I can also... Okay, once I get this armor, then I can go back and be friends with Boone. Okay, I guess we're doing this. Oh, please be safe, Raul the Ghoul. No, please stop. I don't want to gain any more infamy. Like, come on, guys. They shot first. This is a hatchet I would love to bury. And I wish I could. But I just have to kill. I'm not even sure if I'm going to be siding with the NCR, so like... Okay, I guess we're doing is it going to be worthwhile in the, in the end? I do not know. That's a cactus, Alfred. That's a cactus you're shooting at. I even zoomed in. I was like, what is that? Oh, shit, man. All right. It's not an NCR hit squad, I don't think. Because they were like... They, did, they didn't even warn me. Okay, I just want to get to ground level. Can you guys permit me that? Right. I'm already missing all those gecko, the gecko meat that I threw away. Oh, back up, back up. Back up, Arizona Tex. You're in danger. few more of that. I'll take one of these. I don't, like, nothing's broken yet, but just a precaution. You know. Ounce of prevention's worth a pound of cure, remember. And I'm nothing if not preventative. Get one of these out. Take another one of these. Get some more gecko steak. I'm sorry. Just 
shooting someone in the head and shouting, I'm sorry. Like, I know I don't seem very apologetic. You know, that's, that's the problem. I don't seem sorry, but I am. I wish it didn't have to be this way. Oh, I shouldn't put that on yet. There we go. Oh god, and I'm encumbered as well, huh? This NCR service rifle is crap. I remember trying to use it. Uh, it's not very good. Be honest with you. All right. Oh, man. Patrol the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winner. your sergeant, huh? Alright. I need more food. That's the last of that. Yeah, see, I I've mentioned it before, but, like, the thing about having all cowboy guns is that they all take so long to shoot, you know? Like, I don't have a machine gun. I can't get a machine gun. Let's have one of these. That should, uh, that should pick me up. Okay, roll's good. Oh god, I'm sorry. I've been doing this longer than you. I really do wish it didn't have to be this way, but... These are the games we must play. Do you like hearing me just madly click this mouse? Oh, 100 bucks NCR. That's cool. All right, now where's this last crumb bomb? There you are. Come on. Give it up. Look, what what is your plan here, dude? You seen a guy, what am I even Oh fuck. What am I yeah, I'm dressed like this. Shit, yeah, I need a doctor's bag. Probably need two, in fact. I need more. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. Um, take this crap off of me. And how's my uh, varmint rifle? It's okay. Had a very good shower today. All right. Some good side questy goodness going on here. Okay, cool. Then we take this, and we're good.
So the plan is to just combine all the service rifles, then make a super gun. I want my uh, disguise to be better. How's that looking? Perfect. Very good, in fact. Okay, now where am I heading? Um. Yeah, so now every everywhere that I would be hated, I am now neutral because I'm disguised. Guy Incognito, that's my name. Um, hmm. Back to Good Springs, I guess. I've got some shit to hawk. Howdy. Howdy. And while I'm here, I guess I could also get some more supplies. You looking to buy Shit, some supplies? You, you hiding from me? Okay. Uh, I'll get rid of that. And that. Don't need that. Okay. Now I'll sell this. This is my spare. I don't really think I'll need the missile launcher, you know? Oh yeah, the Silence 22 pistol, the best gun in the game. Everyone knows. .357 HD cylinder. I've got a .357, right? That reminds me, I can probably go like hack some shit over there. Give me a right? shout if you take it easy now. Take it easy. Uh, Raul. I'm sure you'll be fair and equitable, boss. I need this back. You can keep that. Uh, you take this service rifle, and it takes 556. So yeah, um. You take a few of those. That's good. Okay, cool. You looking to buy some supplies? Did I actually pick anything up I wanted to sell? I don't think I did. Take it easy now. Take it easy. Or if I have picked up something I wanted to sell, I've already forgotten. No, wait. They're between his store and this one, right? Okay. Uh, nice. It's a, that's a good looking gun right there. And my weight is pretty good. Or so I'd classify it. All right, well. Come right here. And you know what? What can I do for you, boss? We'll come back for him later. I think I need to head on without you. Good call. I mean, if that's what you really want, boss. I think it's for the best. Wait. Forget what I said. Your decide. That's why you're the boss. You always make the right decision. I'll just head home. Home to my lonely abandoned shack. In the middle of nowhere. I'll come back for you. Okay. There's a whole lot of stuff in here that I don't... Oh, he took everything with him. I'm okay with that. 
Uh, but yeah, that's this episode. Next time we will go back to Novak, and I'm going to do Boone side quest, and we're going to unlock Boone as a companion. So yeah, um, I'm an alpha. This has been Fallout New Vegas. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye You fought valiantly, but to no avail. Your twisted and ruined body goes down in a hail of bullets, and thus ends your life in the wasteland.